Do you teach diesel engine technology at your school? Do you have donated engines or engines already in your program that are not yet teaching aids? For over 15 years, Consolab has been taking schools' donated engines and transforming them into training aids like this one. This is a 2014 Peterbilt that we've transformed into a training aid. Now we can do this for Cummins, Caterpillar, uh, John Deere, uh, Mercedes engines, anything you can imagine. So what does a diesel engine bench like this look like? We've got the control panel for the instructor where we've got an instrument cluster, J1939 CAN bus instrument cluster. We've got test points for all the wires going to the control unit. We've got our controls for things like the PTO, for the Jake brake, for the fan clutch, for regeneration, brake pedal, clutch pedal. We have our gas pedal down here and we have taken all the components off of the vehicle and we've made it easily accessible and teachable for you. We've created our own small fuel cell, we've added a fault box, but everything else is from the truck. So this is a Cummins ISX 15 liter engine. We've got the air to air radiator from the truck, but you can see that we've taken it and we've made it safe. So we put protective grills over all the rotating parts. We've put protective grill over the radiator and air to air, and we've added things to make it easier in your classroom. So your battery packs are here. You've got an integrated smart charger so you can leave it plugged in. And then what we've done is we've taken the after treatment system and we moved it off to the side so that your students can do further analysis of the system and better understand in greater detail how the after treatment system works. So we've got the DEF tank, we've got the DPF, the diesel oxidation catalyst, the selective catalytic reduction, as well as all the sensors that go along with it. So let's fire up the engine and see what we can do. So now, using the fault box, we can insert all kinds of different faults and scenarios. So I've got a computer here, tablet computer, I'm just going to take a USB cable and plug it into the fault box. Now the faults that we can insert with the fault box and using the software on our tablet computer, they're not just simple open circuits. We can change circuit voltage, circuit signals, and we can do all of those faults intermittently. So I'm going to fire up the engine and we're going to see what we can do. Good luck to your students in figuring out those problems. Now, using the integrated breakout box, we can use either a multimeter or an oscilloscope, and we can take measurements of the different sensor signals. Now, we've got a guide for all the pinouts that is there for the students and the instructors. So if you're interested in taking one of your donated engines and turning it into a real teaching tool, give us a call or find out more at consolab.com or you can follow us on Facebook, Twitter or LinkedIn. Thanks for watching.